I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Saturday morning, the 20th of January, 2024, and this is your friend, Angus Bucken, with a thought for the day. We start off in the Gospel of John, chapter 20, and I'm reading verse 29. Jesus said to him, Thomas, because you have seen me, you have believed. Blessed are those who have not seen and yet have believed. To trust in the Lord, whom we haven't seen with our physical eyes, takes faith. Now, I want to give you an example. We have a men's prayer meeting at Shalom at five o'clock in the morning. We've been doing it for years. When I leave my little house and I get in my pickup to drive up to the church, I can't see the church, but I know it's there. Now, the reason I know it's there is because we have a big cross just in front of the church. That cross has got a time switch on it. And when the sun goes down at night, the light comes on. A beautiful big cross. In fact, some of the pilots in the nearby airport have told us that sometimes when they lose their bearings coming into land at night, they look for the cross and the cross directs them. Now, when I drive up to the church to have our prayer meeting at five o'clock in the morning with faithful men, I can't see the church, but I know it's there. How come? Because I can see the light of the cross. Now, I want to say to you today, you might not have seen the Lord Jesus Christ physically, but you know He's there. How do you know He's there? Because He lives inside your heart. His Holy Spirit is the light. And Jesus' word, the Bible, is our direction. Today, we are not going to walk by sight. We are going to walk by faith. 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 7. Have a wonderful day today as you walk by faith and not by sight because Jesus is there, heaven is there, and we're going to get there one of these days very soon. God bless you and goodbye.